Go, baby. Go. Really bouncing this way. It's a nice one to start the day right there. Sheesh. Feels small too. Thought maybe there was one or two. One sitting in there. That big little largey right there. Where is it? Here it came off. Sheesh. Pretty nice stout one. Nice little largey right there. Hell yeah, a little pre-spawn largey. Hiding up under the mat. I'll take that all day. Just a quick little measurement. Send you on your way. That's a nice one right there, bro. Sheesh. 18 inch row. All right, guys, there it is. 18 inch, nice little Margie. Largy through the wacky rig sinkle right on the edge of the mats, and boom, she choked it. All right, girl. Thank you. Get ready for that spawn. Go make some babies. He's out. All right, guys, I caught that one on a little wacky rig sinkle with the weedless hook, just black. Black Yum Dinger. Confidence. Got a lot of confidence in that bait. When I first started bass fishing, that was the go to color right there is black because I didn't know anything else. So, just, you know, whatever you guys have confidence in, that's key. If you don't have confidence in the bait you're throwing, then. You know, you're going to have a rough day. Because as long as you're, if you're throwing something you have confidence in, then you know there's a chance you might catch something. But if you're just out there experimenting, you know, it's good to experiment here and there. But every once in a while, just throw the old wacky rig Sanko around some grass edges like this. And Anyways, guys, I know I didn't do an intro, but today we're out here on the California Delta, obviously. Actually, we got a trailer, a new trailer finally, so basically I came out here just to test it out a bit and it works pretty good and I like it. It's awesome. So I'll probably do a video on it coming up of how I built it for my kayak specifically and little modifications I made. We can get a couple more to buy it today. That was on low tide, so I'm catching fish on low tide. Can't complain. Wacky worm by, huh? Probably a little mill. Trying to come up and see what's up. Oh. A little 
striper. Striper. Striper and big bass. What is it? Oh. School striper. Yes, sir. Finally, man. I knew I was chasing this little school something out for a good minute. Mm -hmm. Striper. Striper. Probably won't keep. Eighteen. Yeah, fourteen and a half. That's just a little fourteen inch striper. Send the guns. Some pretty colors on it. Nope. No squeaker. Stacking them up. supposed to be. Alright, 14 and a half. Alright guys, there's another one. Wind started picking up. Spinner bait. Right where you were supposed to be in the toolies. Thank you. Little 14 inch spinner bait and the tooly clumps. Let's see if we can get another one. This little tooly clump right here. There's another one. There's another one. Stacking up in there. All right. That's what I'm talking about. Limit on the delta. Small limit, but hey. Can I complain? Another 
12 incher. 12 incher. Spinner baits put them in some work. Can we catch another one? All right. Well, we already pulled three fish out of this little tooly clump right here. Can we pull another one out? Not even using live scope either. Just have the live scope on, but I'm not even using it. I was using it for striper only. <laughs> 